today is uh, June or July 28th, 2021, midpoint of my summer vacation up here at the Finger Lakes National Forest. Been doing some of the state parks. I did uh, Watkins Glen on Monday. Just the pool. I didn't want to do the trail. I should do the trail, but I've been lazy. I'm just kind of hanging out at camp a lot. And then uh, yesterday I did Robert Treeman. I went to the uh, gorge swimming. Went in there for about 10 minutes and then a thunderstorm came. Again, because I didn't get a real early start because I was lazy and I've just been enjoying camp. Doing a lot of reading and some writing and thinking. And uh, yeah, it's been pretty good. Since I've gotten out here, I've uh, overcome some of my anxiety problems. Um, beginning of this trip, I was just very anxious about everything. It was really kind of silly. But uh, I'm working on changing some things in my life. Um, but yeah, I had pancakes for breakfast. I ended up setting up the tent at this site even though I'm not camping in it just because I have so many dirty clothes and things like the charcoal I want to keep dry but I don't really want it in my truck because it's just a lot of work to move between the front and the back. Uh, last night was kind of interesting after the thunderstorm there's a good old boy and his uh, 12 valve diesel you know big Dodge Ram. Uh, I think he's playing around on the shoulder of the road with his big truck and he got stuck and uh, got, I gave him a shovel and we tried to dig it out and he didn't have any luck. He didn't have a tow chain, neither did I. Oh, it look, looks like the rain just knocked loose at the tarp. Um, so yeah, he's big 12, 12 valve. Uh, I don't know if I could have got it out of my, with my truck because you know it's gas or with stock gears, but uh, he didn't have a chain at any rate, neither did I. So I ended up driving him out to Hector where he could call some of his buddies because he didn't have his, his cell phone was dead too and uh, he didn't have his num the number for him so he had to go and drive, drive him to Hector and he uh, he uh, got his he could have, had his sister was working there and they called some buddies and they got their uh, uh, suburb lifted Suburban with 411 gears gave a little yank and he was out of the, the, the mud hole pretty easily but uh, yeah it gave some entertainment for a Tuesday evening Smashed my phone yesterday. I dropped it on the pavement and there's some gravel and it just went crack. Got a year out of it. It's not an expensive phone. I think you can get used ones for 20 bucks. So I'm not complaining too much about that. It sucks that I, I have a phone with a broken screen while camping, but it is what it is. I'm not going to get one until I get back home. But I was using my phone too much. Even though I don't have service here, I've been playing up with it a lot. You know, do a lot of like blogging and stuff and just thinking and I should be doing more time reading and I should be out on the trails doing more hiking. It's so cool now and nice. I probably will because it's only 60 or 70 degrees out. It's really almost too cold to swim. Um, haven't gotten the kayak out. I should get that out. Um, I mean, I brought it all the way out to the finger like it's stupid to have it locked up at camp all day. But uh, it's a pain to get on and off the truck. And today is breezy, so I'm not sure if I really want to go out in the water with the crack because the, the, the finger like you're all going to be super choppy. Um, so I'm thinking today I'll probably go out to Texas Hollow, do some hiking till I don't know, mid afternoon, then go for a quick evening swim to get, get the sweat washed off in uh, Watkins Glen, maybe do a hike there, sit down by the lake, get some more ice cream. I uh, might need ice, I'm not sure. It's cooled down so it's not so, the heat isn't, uh, you know, melting the ice so quick, but, um, yeah. I like this campsite a lot. I couldn't get it until till Sunday afternoon, but I moved in, and as you can see, I'm pretty well established now, and, uh, I'm gonna stay here till, su uh, uh, through the next Sunday, and then I'm heading home, but, uh, yeah. Nice, pretty with the flags and the wind. And the sun's coming out. It was rainy last night. It rained in the evening. And then uh, this morning it was very cloudy. But now it's a nice summer day. Cool though. Only about 70 degrees. But I mean, beggars, can't be, or beggars can't be complainers. And uh, it is summer vacation. I'm 300 miles from Albany. And uh, just able to just kind of enjoy, enjoy things. And it's another world away from... Uh, from work and all the other problems I have and I'm just trying to really make the best of it and just enjoying the hammock and uh, enjoying summer.
because it's going to be gone before you know it, especially with the cold weather. <laughs> I can't believe I've rambled on for five minutes about camp, but uh, I haven't done too many videos of camp, and this is going to be a hopefully a real nice day. Right, thank you for watching.